Good morning from me and Figment. <laughs> What's up guys? It is day 127 days until we go to Walt Disney World. I think that's right. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's that. It keeps clicking down like that. That's crazy. Anyway, so I'm drinking out of my Figment cup. And I got this cup when we were at Epcot, me and Aubrey, and it was for, you know, filling out those little cards that you can get where you go to all the different spots and you um, find like hidden, it's kind of like a treasure hunt. And then at the end of it, you can get a prize. And they had the Figment cup. It was really cool. And that was for the Flower and Garden Festival. So um, when we go, in January, I think that's the art festival. So that will have been, I've been to the wine festival, the uh, food and wine festival. I've been to the flower and garden festival and then I would be at the art festival. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, <clears throat> as you can see behind me, I don't know if you can see that, but my yard is a hot mess. And I need to do my yard today, so that's what I'm gonna be doing today. <laughs> so I have the ball cap on and the old dance spot t-shirt <clears throat> so that I can get to the yard. So that's what I'll be doing today. Yay for me. <laughs> What's up everybody? Okay, I have on my Alice in Wonderland shirt. I have on my Mickey Mouse hat. And that's because my last shirt got all messy. Did not get a chance to go out and do the yard work. It was really, really hot, so not happening. Aubrey's home from school. Aubrey, say hi. Hi. She's eating her Dunkaroos for her snack. And then I have in my Disney crock pot, Look at how cute this is. Here, I'll show you, hold on. So I have, this is a Disney crock pot the girls got me, I think two years ago. <laughs> Disney crock pot, I love it. It's Pixar, if you didn't know. And I have in here a pot roast, the first one of the cold part of the season. We like to do chili in here. I do chicken and noodles. And now I have a pot roast. So <laughs> we're gonna eat that up for dinner tonight while the girls are in the other room. Um, we are gonna start fin finalizing our plans for Walt Disney World and options in case we can't go on airfares or whatever. That kind of stuff, where the extra money is gonna come from if we're going to do dessert parties, all that stuff. And so after I have that meeting with them, then I'll tell you guys all about it afterwards. Aubrey just got done watching the Tim Burton version of Alice in Wonderland. Did you like it? Yes! I was like... She was so into it, right? Yeah. So tonight we're having a movie night and we are going to start... What movie are we going to start watching? She's ready for Harry Potter now. So we're gonna start the Harry Potter series. And I already have it all comfy. She, we got it all set up for us to like get comfy on the couch and have popcorn and have a movie night since it's Friday. And we're gonna start with Harry Potter. It's perfect yes, it's for tomorrow. Universal. You need to know all about Harry Potter. Yeah, and tomorrow we have a day off from school. So you guys can just see us tomorrow. Yeah, we'll have another big fun day tomorrow, right? <laughs> I'll get Aubrey to help me. We're going to start on the yard tomorrow, huh, Aubrey? Yeah. Because we got to get ready for what? What are we going to decorate next weekend? Halloween! <laughs> My favorite holiday. So we're going to be excited about pulling out all the Halloween decorations and getting that started next weekend. So yeah, all right, I'm off to talk with the girls and I will see you afterwards, bye. Okay, so we are done with our uh, big talk and our big talk was basically that we are trying to figure out our budget and figure out how we were gonna be able to pull off 
the finances that are expected for the trip, including our airfare, souvenirs, food, and uh, various stuff. So lots of big changes. <laughs> The biggest one is the fact that we pushed up the vacation date. We are now leaving on the 18th. Originally, we were going to leave on the 23rd, or we were going to be at Disney on the 23rd. Now we are going to be at Disney on the 18th of January, which means we are now 122 days. That's right. Look at this. 122 days away from going to Disney. So that's awesome that I got to do that. Now that's part one. Part two of the changes are, <laughs> once again, we're changing the resort. We are now spending the entire 10 days of our vacation at the Contemporary. <laughs> so now we are going to spend January 18th to the 27th, which is 10 days of our vacation, staying at the Contemporary in the Garden Suite, or Garden Wing. Um, it's our favorite resort, mine and Courtney's especially. This trip is also for Courtney's birthday. So that's the reason why we're doing that. It's actually saving us money because we're no longer spending the money on the universal part of the, the vacation. We are now putting that all towards the contemporary, which means I don't have to pay any more on that. That part of the vacation is done because we're just going to transfer the money that we were putting towards Universal and we're putting it towards the Disney part of it. So for 10 days, I get more days in Disney and the girls are going to do one day at Universal and get a transfer like a mirrors transfer which is like a car service that will take them from the contemporary over to Universal for one day. I'm not a big Universal person and Aubrey's still too little to really enjoy Universal so they're going to do one day at Universal themselves and uh, do their Harry Potter stuff there. Uh, they'll be vlogging that. I asked them if they'll vlog that. So they said they'll vlog that while me and Aubrey do something else. We'll probably do Magic Kingdom, of course, and maybe go to another resort or go to another park, park hop that day. So the vacation is completely changed again, but I'm excited about this one because now I get to spend the entire 10 days at the contemporary and you guys know how much I love the contemporary if you've watched my other vlogs that we have done I cry every time I go to the contemporary I love it I love sitting up on that upper deck where I can look out at the magic kingdom and now I can even watch the fireworks from there and we're talking about adding a dessert party now whereas before we didn't know if we could afford that so we're talking about maybe doing the harmonious dessert party and uh yeah so I think this is going to be the better plan and I'm really excited about it. So that's how today went. Today was a day of changes and plans. So, <laughs> so that's it for today. Um, uh, it was a real quick and easy vlog today. Um, nothing really big and exciting other than these big changes. And I'm glad that we're going to do this um, and I'll keep you posted. <laughs> I can't believe it in 20 days from now or 20 yeah 20 days from now I will be hitting the 100 mark and that's like a big deal once you start counting down and you're at 100 days till you go it's going to be intense it's going to be awesome this also gives me an opportunity to also purchase like some stuff from Etsy for our trip um, and, uh, start adding that. And then that way we've got outfits to wear. I mean, it just opens up more opportunities for us to do more things that we normally wouldn't have done. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm super stoked. So, uh, here we go on to our next vacation is going to be at the contemporary for 10 whole days. Yes. So in the next vlog that I do, besides uh, the last day of our vacation, I'll be telling you what restaurants we have chosen and the reasons why we've chosen those restaurants. So um, yeah, that'll be in the next one. All right, I hope you guys have a great day and enjoy my next vlog coming up. 
Um, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out. Love you. Bye.